Yo, what is going on guys? Sidnote 34 here. Welcome back to another video. On today's video, this is going to be the top five best candy flavors that Chief Hill has, in my opinion. Um, so if you guys are picking up some candy flavors, you want to know what to pick up, then this is the video for you. And this is my own opinion. It may differ between people. Um, but yeah, so this is my opinion. Coming into an honorable mention, this is actually my least favorite Chief Hill flavor. I've never enjoyed it. It is Twisted Candy. Now, I know that I know people that actually this is their number one favorite flavor, but for me, I just I've never never enjoyed it. Um, it's not terrible to the point where I can never drink it again, but I just don't choose this flavor at all. I never drink it. I don't think I'm gonna finish the tub. I don't know. We'll see. But it's just not good. It just tastes. It's I don't even know how to describe the taste. It kind of tastes like limes and Smarties, but it just has this weird aftertaste or something. I don't even know. But yeah, it's just not good in my opinion. So getting in, that was the item of mention. Getting into the actual top five, I'm gonna have to give number five spot to cotton candy. Now this flavor is actually vaulted at the moment, um, so you can't really pick it up. I think you can get it on Walmart's website, walmart.com. I'm not 100% sure if they still have it. I know they did have it, but you can check if you guys really want it. Um, but yeah, it's it's just not good. It tastes like sweet sugar toilet water. If you guys are asking me how I know what toilet water tastes like, I don't. I'm just saying it, it just has a weird taste to it. It's literally just sweet sugar water. I, I don't know. It's disgusting. Um, my tub is pretty low. I don't even know how it's this low. I, I have that with some G Fuel tubs that are just low, even though I don't drink them, which doesn't really make sense. Oh god, I just smelled the powder. The, sm the powder kind of smells good, I'm not going to lie, but it's just, I don't know, the flavor is kind of nasty, um, in my opinion. You can't even get that anymore. You might be able to, but in, on a different website. But yeah, coming into the number four spot, I'm going to have to give it to Rainbow Sherbet. I was about to say Sherbet. Uh, Rainbow Sherbet. This basically just tastes like an orange soda to me. It's not bad, don't get me wrong. I just, I don't really drink this flavor either. I'm a fruity flavor kind of person. So I don't really drink the sweet candy flavors. Um, my friend, actually, he really likes this. This is his number one flavor. I, I just don't enjoy it at all. I mean, okay. It's good, but I just never drink it. That's what I'm trying to say. It's good. I just don't drink it. It tastes like an orange candy. I almost just freaking knocked over a bunch of stuff back here. It just tastes like an orange soda candy type flavor. Um, but coming into the number three spot, I'm going to have to give it to Snow Cone. I love snow cone. I think it's a really good flavor. But yeah, this flavor is really good for the summertime. Um, I recommend it. It does have a weird aftertaste to it, but once you start drinking it more, you get used to it. It kind of tastes like the ice to a snow cone. Um, but yeah, so they do have packets of, I think, all these flavors except cotton candy. Um, well, not the flavors behind me. But yeah, so they have a bunch of packets for these flavors. So go ahead and pick up some packets if you guys aren't sure. But yeah, so that's number three flavor. I really like it. It's like in my top five. I don't get a lot. But yeah, coming into the number two spot, I'm going to have to give it to Raging Gummy Fish. Now, I know my top five, I didn't put Raging Gummy Fish up there, and I put Snow Cone in there, but I just don't drink Raging Gummy Fish that often, and I think it's actually kind of a really light flavor, so that's why I don't drink it too much. Um, don't get me wrong, it's a really good flavor. It wasn't in my like, original top five, but I just don't drink it that much. Um, I have less than half tub. This is probably my lowest tub. This Pink Grapefruit and Phase Berry are like my lowest tubs. Um, so I'm trying to save this kind of too. It just tastes like a Swedish fish with like a raspberry taste to it. It's just really good. Um, I just, I'm trying to savor the tubs that are lower, even if they're like delicious. I'm just trying to savor them. But that's a really good candy flavor. So getting into the number one spot, the number one candy flavor that I think you guys should pick up if you just, if you want to try out a candy flavor. Um, so yeah, the number one spot, I'm going to have to give it to Bubblegum. I've been drinking this flavor non-stop since I got it. I literally am having some right now, some bubblegum. Uh, but yeah, so I got bubblegum here. It's number one spot for me. I think it's really good. It kind of does have a weird aftertaste to it, like a sourness type thing, but it's a really good initial taste. Um, this is, Again, the tub design is amazing. The flavor is amazing. I, I say go for this one if you guys want to pick up a candy flavor or Raging Gummy Fish, Snow Cone, whatever you guys want to try out. There's packets for most of these flavors. Um, I don't think there's for bubblegum yet, but yeah, that is my number top, my number top five, that makes sense. My top five most candy flavors, whatever you want to call it. Um, so yeah, if you guys are trying out any of these flavors, let me know. Um, I think, I think I rank them pretty good in my opinion. Bubblegum is amazing. Raging Gummy Fish is good, Snow Cone, all the rainbow shirt, all the rainbow shirts, yeah, whatever. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, give it a big old thumbs up, subscribe if you guys are new, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out, everyone.